And good evening, ladies and gentlemen, to CTW Fully Loaded. Oh. I'm one of your hosts, A or <laughs> Andrew the Soldier Sutter. Watch sorry. Yourself. I know, I'm sorry. My partner, uh, Alan, JT. a little no. bit of a hiatus. John. It's John. He's, he's on a hiatus, yeah. I'm saying, John. I'm not going to confuse you. I know you're twins, oh. Man. but I, I can tell the difference, all right? Uh, so, John, how you doing tonight? I'm Excited. good. I haven't seen my brother. That's about all I'm worried about here. But um, let's not worry about that because we got a million dollar championship on the line tonight. Ray Phoenix defending this belt after re getting it back from who was it? Wow. Who was it? <laughs> who was it after? It, um, it after was Ray Phoenix? Okada. Okada. Ray, oh yeah. Oh yeah, Okada. Okada oh yeah, I remember. Room. Because Ray Phoenix laid him in the dirt. Yeah, after he beat Pentagon, yeah. He, right. He got his revenge. But Okada, he's he's crazy here in CTW. He, he's been on a hell of a win streak. Yeah, he, I mean, he lost the belt, but he won straight to the belt. Straight to the belt. And someone here that wants to get straight to the belt. Jericho, the Ayatollah of Rock and Rolla, the Lion Tamer. One part of the entourage here. Y2J. This man has many names, and he has many names on the list. And is for the million dollars. Or lexicon, depending on you know how you know him. Introducing the challenger from Winnipeg, Manitoba, Canada, weighing in at 227 pounds. Manitoba. Chris. Jericho not doing a whole lot of singles work here at CTW. He's gone after the Voltage title a couple times and always fell short in the titles match. Do uh, you think he has a good shot here tonight? Um, I don't know, Samoa Joe. We haven't seen him in a while, but I, you, you always know Joe's going to go crazy. Whatever that guy gets in that ring, you better watch out. Um, but Chris Jericho is one of the best, um, might be the best in wrestling history. So, um, mm -hmm. yeah, he might be able to do it. Look at that. Listen to that. You can get the crowd behind him. Absolutely. You got to give it up for a legend. Uh, I just realized Samoa Joe, last time we saw him, last pay-per-view. <laughs> really? Yeah. And depending on how he performs tonight, we might not see him until the next one. And introducing the challenger from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds. Well, Joe's just Samoa one of those people that Joe. you just can't put into a, just a random match. You know, you always got to, he's at that title scene. And, you know, even though he sometimes falls short, I can always see Joe might hold that um, fire or voltage belt one day. I could see it. Um, I think he, he certainly has the power, the tenacity. He just needs to refine that skill just a little bit, and he has it. And there's your million-dollar champ right there. And introducing the champion from Mexico, weighing in at 162 pounds, he is the million dollar champion, Ray Furious. Yeah, Ray Fast and the Furious coming out here tonight. Um, that's the advantage that Ray Phoenix here has. He has speed behind him. Yes. This guy can do things in the ring that I haven't seen anyone else even attempt. And that's saying a lot coming from the Lucha background. Song Not, is absolutely crazy. Just like Ray Phoenix. Uh, yeah, and and the, crowd, the crowd, the love him. Being, being half of the Lucha Brothers, I mean, that's going to, uh, it's going to up your status in the world for sure. Chris Jericho getting ready, getting those boot, those leather boots laced. Here we go. 
But oh my god! DDT oh, ran man. under Ray Phoenix! It's the Mojo's <laughs> getting the crowd going. Oh my gosh! Falcon oh. Arrow! Falcon Arrow out of just... Just out of nowhere, the swiftness is Jericho. Even though he Met might be the older man here. Yeah. Still moves like a 20 year old. Oh! Little tag team action there. Oh, Joe just taking out the champion. Over the ropes, and Chris Jericho has to think what the hell just happened. Trying to shake off the cobwebs. Oh, my that's, God. That's not going to help. Look at this, oh, Joe. Just camel clutch. Camel clutch. Jericho fighting out of it, though. Oh. Woo! Woo! Big, Big chop from Jericho. Nice kick to the midsection. And once again just did a drop kick from Ray Phoenix. Zero! Oh! oh. oh my God. <laughs> and Joe runs over and clubs Ray Phoenix like a baby seal over the head. Now remember this is no holds barred match. To be honest, I'm not really too familiar with no holds barred match like my brother. So what is really a no holds barred match Ooh. here in CTW? I don't know. We're gonna find out I think out they here just tonight, let him go. I think it's no rope breaks. I think it, uh, nothing can can save you. Uh -oh. um, you just gotta win. You gotta oh pin my. or submit them. Damn. Joe, he caught the legs of Ray Phoenix. Oh, look at this. Look at Jericho. And Jericho just doing what he does. Whoa. Miss. Like trying to get a sneaky punch on. Trying to get a sneaky punch on Ray Phoenix. Sneaky snap, snap suplex. Jinx, you owe me a coke. <laughs> oh, oh my god. god. The Ray slam. Puts Joe over the top of this time, but Joe's right at the. Wow. wow. They didn't phase Joe Playing at all. A little bit of in and out, a little cat and mouse. Poor Jericho just getting stomped by both men. Right, Phoenix! <laughs> this, is, this, is this is a spinning cartwheel kick. Arm drag. Look at Joe with those nice right jabs. Watch this bell. Oh my, oh my god. Trying to kick the mask off Ray Phoenix. Ray, Ray Phoenix, Phoenix, the drop kick doesn't drop him. He oh, tries it again. Slaps. Jericho. What is this? Oh, oh my god. A, like a cross double uh, calf cr uh, breaker. Uh oh. Jericho. He's looking for it. Man, those are some big legs to get off of her. He's got the walls locked in. Ray Phoenix broke it though. He may have just saved Joe. Drop kick. Ray Phoenix says he's calling it. Staring down Jericho. Oh. Oh. What's gonna happen? Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Bronco Buster on the ropes. A little bit of X Pac here tonight. Remember when X Pac used to do that? Oh yeah, this was in the turn bunk. I guess it wasn't a Bronco bus. It was like, or it was an inverted Bronco. I think he did a turn bunk. Uh, Ray or Phoenix was... is going after everyone. That's Road Dog that did it on the road. Yeah, you're right. Oh, Ray man. Phoenix, Mojo, back and forth, and Chris Jericho playing possum on the ropes. Look at that! I told you. See him jump out of the way. Whoa. Oh my god, the strength of Joe! <laughs> Super high German. Let's recover. Jericho An opportunist it. Chris Jericho. What the hell? Cannot... He's getting, he's getting oh my god! And Joe just walked <laughs> right into it. Oh! oh, oh the disrespect! Jericho is playing, playing with Joe's mind. Hyperextending that wrist. <laughs> oh! Joe gets out of it though. Jericho. For how long? Oh, brain Buster. God. Brain Buster. Brain Phoenix goes for the pin. <laughs> Jericho breaks it. The crowd is going wild. They want Ray Phoenix. Oh my 
my God. Oh, giant over the rope power bomb. <laughs> Already. Oh, my God. <laughs> and a jump up Hurricane Rana. Ray Phoenix goes after Joe. He needs to pin someone. Jump up Ray Phoenix. A little bit of the pump action. Oh, my Spanish God. fly. Spanish fly. The strength of Ray Phoenix. He might have him. That might oh. be it. Dude, no. Joe no. kicks out in Jericho crawling. Mm -hmm. Ray Phoenix does eyes. not look discouraged, and he's going up top. I wonder if Jericho's gonna let this happen. Jericho not. Oh, oh my God! Oh. Throwing him on the back with Joe, going for the pin. Joe's staggered. Dude. Oh, he almost snuck that. Joe still doesn't know where he is. <laughs> Joe can't believe where he's at. He's at fully loaded, baby. And this is a fully <laughs> open, fully loaded car tonight. Oh my, oh my god, that looked so painful. That's whiplash. Joe getting tangled in the ropes. One. One. Joe just kicking out at one, still has heart in his badge, even though he doesn't know where he's at. Yeah. Turnbuckle. What's Jericho going to do? Get kicked in the face, that's what. Just fighting. Ray Phoenix Back is and watching, forth. catching his breath. DDT at Jericho. Ooh. Nice DDT from Joe. That's what I'm talking about. That was a really tight technique. Oof, wasn't, as, wasn't as good as that. Oh, was Ray Phoenix threw a little celebration here in the middle of the ring. Little Viva La Raza. <laughs> Back Jericho and just forth. crawling. Crawling to the ring post. One. Joe's like, look, I don't even have to touch anything. But he will stand there and let Ray Phoenix work on the face of Jericho. Uh oh. Oh. Oh my God. <laughs> this is crazy. Everyone's just right, in the middle of the ring. Kick on the knee. Breaks Joe's the knee pin. might be hurt. His knee might be hurt. Oh, catches Jericho spinning, with that kick. Spinning back kick lands. Jericho! German! Abridged! One! Oh. oh my god! Hits the Falcon Arrow. No one gets out of the Falcon Arrow at all. Lions all! Lions all. Lance flush! Joe can't, can't believe it. Believe his fucking eyes that that man's moving like that. Jericho oh, jumps. look at the dodge. Push Joe on his fucking knees. Oh, Jericho's fighting. He's fighting. Oh, call call breaker. Call breaker. Call call breaker. Oh, Jericho needs this. Jericho. He wants it so bad. Going for the pin. Two. One. Three. Three. He got it. Yes. He got it. Oh my god! Chris Jericho with an absolutely amazing performance. Chris Joy Jericho becomes Phil. Le Phil Champion. Million dollar hitting, Le Champion. Hitting the lion salt and then reversing the ducking under Joe's sprinting clothesline and then reversing his next move into a code breaker. It doesn't get any better than that. Here is your winner and the new million dollar champion, Chris Jericho. There you go, Chris Jericho coming out tonight. Fantastic. It just going ape shit bananas. I, I loved every second of that. Absolutely awesome. And that was just the beginning. Oh shit, looks like I gotta get out there. Oh, yeah. wish me luck, John. Oh, I wish you, because you know what? You might want to commit some suicide tonight after this match if you don't want to win. Just saying, suicide tonight is gonna be going crazy on Andrew Sutter. And Andrew Sutter is bringing out that Titan, that Fury, onto suicide. Hello everyone, of course, the my name is Chuck Darkstein. Nice to see you, John. Chuck. And it's for oh, the we got the, uh, 
and we got the announcer. Sorry, folks. What type of match was this? I Andrew's need to <clears throat> Yeah, I believe it's uh, this is a, a finisher match. Oh, between the and your finisher. Yeah. It was, you know, we've never seen that before. It's, it's exciting. This whole card is just super exciting. Andrew Sutter coming out here without AT3. Um, yeah, I wait, haven't seen, I, I don't know. I haven't seen him in a while. Ever since he got, um, lost the Duke in that TLC match. He should be out there supporting his, his partner. He's in a different mindset. I don't know where he's at. But Suicide, he's in that champion mindset, baby. Yeah, but Suicide, that, uh, you know, he had a long hiatus, right? And he came yes, back and wow. he's just been... What? This, he is this, all fired up. This, like, yeah. this guy is literal... He's literal Spider-Man. Yeah, you mean he kind of looks like him, right? <laughs> Boom! Cruiserweight Championship is on the line tonight. Introducing the challenger from Athens, Greece, weighing in at 185 pounds, Andrew the Soldier. Introducing yeah. the ready. champion. From Parts champion. Unknown, weighing in at 200 pounds, he is the WWE Cruiserweight Champion, Sue Ace Hine. Suicide, representing the old WWE Cruiserweight Championship tonight. Suicide, of course, hitting that absolute max weight limit you can be for the Cruiserweight. Five minute time limit. Oh man, drop kick right on Sutter. He's not a good sign for the soldier. He's already down on the ground. The suicide's already going up. Oh my oh god. Oh my god. Top rope. Like some bowing drop. <laughs> suicide nice is drop. crazy. He's um a yeah, backdrop. Like you said, on some another level tonight. Soldier catches the punch. Sends me the ropes. Oh! Bulldog out of the corner of the ring. Suicide pops back up. Oh, he oh, misses something. Misses dropkick. Suicide lights the dropkick on Sutter. Oh, look at this. Oh. The soldier's fighting. He's fighting. What is Get this? Get up on his soldiers. Oh, my God. <laughs> what is, was that a one-winged angel? <laughs> I don't know what that was. Oh Look, my I can god. just stole that from Kenny Omega. Suicide throwing. Andrew Sutter over the top rope. Andrew just needs to hit the two time. Or the hellbow. Bang bang! From suicide. Well, yeah, I think the hellbow is the finisher. I think uh the two time is his uh Signature, oh my yes. god. Suicide. Suicide in total control here. Oh man. Oh my just gosh. Fighting. Look at his fast punches. Checking. Light them up. Oh my god. Oh my, oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Left the kick. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Andrew Sutter. He's in the crowd. He can't believe it. He doesn't know where he's at. Wait, there's no count out, right? Suicide just ran back in the ring. No nice backbreaker. Out. Only three minutes left in this match. Someone here has got to land a finisher. Suicide, his third drop kick he's landed. I don't think it matters if it's outside the ring, inside the ring. In the concession stands. It just needs, we just need a finisher here tonight. Andrew Sutter might give it to us right here. Oh my god! Oh, duck under Pele kick. The swiftness 
of Andrew Sutter. Uh oh, the suicide. Look at a little bit. Swift for himself. That too swift. Taylor Swift. <laughs> oh my oh. god. Oh my god. Sandal. Batter up. Oh, oh what's this? What is this? We have Oh my oh. god. Suicide does a kick. Suicide. How, how do you give up from this? Oh! I got down! Oh! oh my god. Get the no time! The referee can't he can't believe his eyes! Suicide is still fighting though! A minute thirty seconds left! This is gonna go down to the wire! It's about his soldiers! Oh my oh, god! Oh god he's late! No! Oh. GTS penalty kick! The soldier in complete control right now. Wiping the sweat off his face. Like it's nothing. Oh, Andrew Sutter's fighting back. Oh my god. 60 seconds. DDT. Alright, we up DDT. This is still anyone's match. Leg drop. <laughs> <laughs> 360 name drop. It's crazy. I've never seen that. Uh oh, this might be it. Suicide. He's going up. 30 seconds. Oh, I just. Uh oh. Oh! oh Splat. He just hits canvas. Oh, here we go. Oh, oh. He just broken open. He's bleeding through his mask. 20 seconds of the clock. The crowd the crowd's crazy! 15 seconds! He's stopping it! So it's down him! He's gotta land his finisher! He just stop it on suicide! Oh my god! Andrew Sutter's getting all caught up by the clock! What the hell is going on? That's it, it's a draw! Oh. It's a draw! Oh yeah, look at the clock! Oh man! Oh. We're gonna have to continue this! Yeah, well, I mean, gee, I wish we could put more more time on the clock. That was such a good match. That was crazy. We're going to have to continue it. Oh, my God. We're going right into Taz versus Mick Foley in a hardcore match. Andrew Sutter not watching the clock in that last 15 seconds. You got to be heartbroken about that. You were so close. I, be, I You know, let me go get him. Oh yeah, I, I know he's gonna be upset. I, I just I give him a pep up. All right, it was good catching up with you, John. Uh, Thank Godspeed, you. peace be with you. Yeah, <laughs> see you next time. Peace be with you, John. Or Chuck. contest is an extreme rules match and is for the WWE <laughs> Hardcore Championship. Taz coming out here tonight winning that number one contenders match and going to face Mick Foley. I, I, I just, the DDTs from Mick Foley versus Taz's just crazy suplexes out of nowhere. You can't beat it. In a first blood match, Mick Foley might have the advantage here tonight. Taz looking ready inside his jumpsuit tonight. He might have it.
And there's your million dollar champ and Mick Foley coming out, always looking a little strange here in CTW, coming out to weird music, coming out in weird pants, shirts, ties, masks. He's crazy here in CTW. But I think that's just Mankind or Mick Foley in general. Um, fully loaded. Um, I'm going to tell you, this match right here is fully loaded. All right, John. Sorry, I had to leave you there for a second. <laughs> uh, Chuck was talking to me. He calmed me down a little bit, but I just need to get this out now before uh, Mick and Taz get, get going at it. Suicide. You know I had that match. You know I deserve that belt. I want you one-on-one. -on -one. This five-minute match, clearly, we're too evenly matched for that. I'm saying triple the time limit 15 minutes you and me Iron Man match but if you Ooh. think you need a little more I'm down for however long you want buddy you just let me know you go to management you tell them Introducing that you agree if you're man enough and we'll settle this damn Andrew Sutter laying it out here tonight right here on fully loaded oh my god oh. and Mick Foley reading Taz like a book whoa big chop Mick Foley, the most dominant hardcore champion. Yeah, as I was saying um, before he drop. came back, um, out of Mick Foley's random DDTs and Taz's just random crazy suplexes, you never know who's going to win tonight. I would say tonight is probably one of the most even matches here for this hardcore Ooh. belt. It's a nice suplex there. Remember, First blood, extreme rules. Taz looking for the table. Nick oh. Foley sees that. Oh, the table bounces off his head as it falls down. Nick Foley looking to make use about. those steps. I mean, that's what I would do. Oh man! Oh, <laughs> knocking him over the barricade. Taz now going over the barricade. They're fighting. They're fighting inside the crowd. <laughs> Mick Foley, one big right hand knocks it back. And Taz is waiting for him. Knocks him back over. Knocks him right back over. Taz wants him. Taz wants him right here. Right here in the right CTW here. universe. They're a being uppercut. This is crazy. Mick Foley and Taz just using the environment. It's all right hands. This is just a bar fight now. The crowd loves it. Crowd is going crazy and Taz is right back over. He doesn't care. <laughs> he wants it right out here. Two big rights. Oh, nice elbow to the ribs by Taz and Taz has him now. <laughs> Mick, no, Foley Mick catches fighting it. Back. Taz fighting back still. Well, maybe he's like, holy shit, he's rethinking here. That's Cactus Jack. That's Mick Foley. That's Mankind. That's Dude Love. All in one Taz. person. Taz is a technical fighter. He doesn't just want to throw right hands with Mick Foley. He has him in the ring. He has more tools to his uh, disposal. Like this, using the ropes. Using, using the ropes. Yeah, I agree with that. Taz definitely, um, I would say Mick Foley has an advantage out there. Exploder suplex. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you can't knock the guy out. <laughs> this is a first blood match. You're just punching him in the face. It's just how long before you get knocked out. Oh my god! Nice, nice stuff, Canero. The strength of Taz, the size of Taz. He's being able to lift that man. Nick Foley, neck breaker. Big, big neck breaker. Ton of impact on that. This is what Taz does. Oh no, work in the oh. face. Look at that. Oh my god. Scissors hold. Giant elbows to the forehead. A ton of scar tissue there from Mick Foley. It's gonna bleed easy just like the Diaz brothers. Oh wow, look at that claw right on the shoulders of Taz. Mick Foley right. just wants to inflict pain. Yeah, that's the thing. Mick Foley just seems to win by 
by sheer circumstance. He's not actually trying to win. He's just trying to hurt his opponent as much as possible and right. just happens to, to, to not beat them. Oh, oh my God. The spider arms. Oh my God, it has us fired up. A Delta World Slam. Yeah, he is. Remember, I got to bust him open. Oh my God, Mick Foley's fighting out of it. I'm looking to maybe land a DDT or something. Maybe some snake eyes here. What's this? Oh, exactly. Mick Foley now size and Taz up. Go Death for the DDT. DDT. Taz fighting. Oh, look at that. It goes straight for Mick Foley's head. Oh, now Mick Foley's not to <laughs> save the Taz. Oh, my God. This is brutal. I can't believe neither of them are bleeding yet. The strength of Taz. It goes straight to Mick Foley's face and crack. Oh. Oh, oh my, my god. god! He can't believe it! Look at this! It oh, he's this. going oh back! My god. He's going back! Twelve direct punches! Fuck it! Taz doesn't care! He just wants to inflict pain now to Mick Foley! Oh, so good. Elbows! 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 That's 15 unanswered strikes to Mick Foley's head! He Mick can't Foley's keep this up! Mick Foley though! Oh, oh. my god! He's 16. dead. He's dead. He's out cold. Taz is a savage. He's still going after him. Oh, kick oh. to the bed section. In the back kick. Oh, Superman punch. He did it. Should he got him. Champ. Oh, my gosh. With this streak of falling. Here's your winner. Over. And the new WWE Hardcore Champion, Taz. Taz. When in that hardcore championship in going style. in hard here in CTW. Unloading 16 just brutal just yeah. punches Fists and, and elbows on both yeah. hands and then he'd trap him with the legs and he drop elbows on the other side. Absolute craziness, but I don't know if there's gonna be a match crazier than this tonight uh this is gonna be a tough one to call not gonna lie josh this i'm excited our only hell in a cell match remember this we do also the main event duke versus brock in a knockout match in a hell in a cell here tonight yes the brothers of destruction versus the Young Bucks versus the OC, already the triple champions, trying to get the 2v2 champions, trying to solidify themselves as the best damn stable tag man. And if there's more more than one man involved, the OC says we're the best at it. Yeah. It's going to be very, very interesting seeing how this match plays out. Brothers of Destruction, by the way, undefeated as yes. a tag team. Yes, undefeated as a tag team. This is true. Now, they have only defended the belt once I was a part of that match and that sucked <laughs> uh, I just basically fought Kane for five minutes and then he killed me and climbed out of the cage now the young box they've been here since day one in CTW always have been in the tag team division but never have got to that belt status yet. They haven't grabbed the belts, and maybe here tonight, maybe this Hell in a Cell stipulation, they might be able to take advantage of it. Uh, yeah, I, I agree that there's a... <laughs> but it's gonna, you're gonna have to go through Hell and back to get those championships from the Brothers of Destruction. Oh man. Kane just fucking scary as shit tonight. This is prime Kane. No two butts about it. 
Yeah, dude, that guy's fucking pumped. <laughs> yeah, go get him. <laughs> dude, everyone loves the Brothers of Destruction. Yeah, uh, super intimidating. Both great Limp careers. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a lot of Limp Biscuit fans in <laughs> the crowd tonight. Here in Detroit, Michigan. The only person they mark out harder for is Kid Rock. <laughs> Ooh. Former tag team champions here. The OC beating, um, formerly known as the crew, for the belts. In devastating fashion. Um, a lot of people think that's the match that actually broke up the crew. That night was just everyone was in shock and awe the crew disbanded the following Monday night and now they're in separate stables but the OC might be able to become the best stable here tonight there is a good chance um, I mean having the 3v3 belt 2v2 belt right Kind of hard to argue. Yes, it is. But oh my and god! Underway. Look at this match in the ring. Is intense. <laughs> this is a 30 <laughs> minute over. time limit. Man. Is this best two out of three? Yes. Oh man, that may have been a mistake by management. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see how this goes. Guarantee we're going to see all 30 minutes here. Andrew Sutter, is there any way you can? dial your mic up. The crowd is so wild here tonight. Oh, sorry about that there. Oh my god. Okay, can I just say there's only three, there's three huge guys. That, I guess it's a, it's a good split down the middle. Oh, here we go. Undertaker's out. Kane's laying down. The Brothers of Destruction. But look at this. The OC stand tall. I mean, we might be right there. The, the, these might be the guys to become 2v2 and 3v3 champions. Yes. Oh, Luke Gallows hit him with that kick. I don't know if that was that odd. Just a normal nice little head kick or what was that? I don't know. Uh, I, I, I couldn't see. There's so much shit going on. Undertaker throwing Gallows back in the ring. You got Carl Anderson and I think uh, Nick Jackson. Oh, going for a cover. Undertaker says no. Oh, super kick. Super kick. And that dead man goes down. It's a cover. Two. Two. No. Undertaker oh. kicks. It's hard to take out Taker this early. It really is. Oh, man. Drop kick on Kane. Going for the pin. Oh my god. Since there's not enough room for the ref, he has to count outside <laughs> by the timekeeper's table. It's very, very difficult. He has to use cameras to oh, actually man. get it. Whoa, nice, nice step up kick. Nick Jackson actually working. Oh. Get, oh, I spoke too soon. This is not where you want to be. Oh, the OC now working on Nick Jackson, I believe. Oh, oh. Breaking open his head. Giant oh, super this. kick. And just now grinded the face. And Matt can only sit there and watch. Slams Carl's head. Matt uh -oh. was going for a super kick for his own. Undertaker's up. Don't see. The young bucks by the outside. They're just bouncing off the apron, bouncing against oh the cage. God, just look out. at this. Carl Anderson get taken out by Nick, who's pissed. His blood dripping down his face now. Now Kane oh, sees Luke. Oh, Luke doesn't know that Kane's right behind him. Oh, oh. He says, fuck it. He goes for Matt Jackson. <laughs> oh, Joke slam. Joke slam. Nick breaks the cover. Oh. Brothers of Destruction now. Taking out the young bucks. Carl Anderson, he's a bad spot. A bad spot. 
Oh, it's tossed by the head. Oh my God! And Kane is just unloading fist onto Carl Anderson. Absolutely brutal right hands. Carl Anderson, though he's spunk, he's got fight in him. Kane kicks down the. It's just, it's just the brothers of destruction and him standing up in the ring here, and it's just the brothers of destruction, your tag team <laughs> champions, standing tall. Oh, what's the big red machine doing? Okay. <laughs> Never know Ooh. what he's gonna do. Undertaker goes for a super kick on Carl Anderson and gets caught. Oh man, Carl Anderson eating steel. Yeah, you don't want to be fighting Kane outside. Oh my god, Carl Anderson's now broken open. No, broken no, I pin. think Why? I think it's uh, Luke Gallo. Oh Three. yeah. Is that the first call? That's the first Nick, pin. Nick Jackson. Oh, yeah, he's got a crucifix. Oh, Kane just sees it. Oh my Whoa. god. Rip cord clothesline. 619 from the Undertaker movie. <laughs> <laughs> he's going yeah, for oh. the dives. Dives over Nick, Nick Jackson. Jackson. Spear. Spear Taker. Nick Jackson's like a man possessed. He is the only pinfall so far, and he did it by super kicking Luke Gallo's forehead wide oh, open. Suck it! Diddy D! Oh, Haggy oh, Diddy T. Nick Jackson is MVP of this match. Look, this he's going after everyone. Cutter! Oh. Cutter! Nick Jackson going for the pin! Nick Take Jackson. Every A step up drop kick as a reward. Oh, <laughs> there, oh, oh there he is. He's rising. He sees Kane. Oh, no. <laughs> Spine Buster. And once again, Brothers of Destruction. You have to get a pinfall, but still standing tall, dominating Young the bucks ring. So far here. At the 24 time limit with the first pin of uh -oh. the night. Uh oh. Uh oh. 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 Carl Anderson reverses it! Tombstone on Undertaker! He tombstone Staker! If Matt Jackson wasn't there, I think that would be a pinfall for the OC. What a reversal. Absolutely stunning. Oh my god, and a crazy spine buster from the OC. Look it's like at a that. choke buster. Ooh, too sweet, baby! Carl Anderson said no. Oh. Matt Jackson kicks. Spear from Nick. The Young Bucks want it. They want They're this going championship. Up. Fly it's all. <laughs> no, it's, it's Luke and Matt. Oh, Luke dodges the spear. Oh, <laughs> Carl dodges another spear from Nick. Spear. spear! Lance on Luke. Nick's back up. Super Super kick kick. <laughs> They're both trying to pin. The ref can only count one pin at a time. Oh, the young buck can mess up. Wow. Spinning cutter from Carl Anderson. Oh Undertaker. Carl trying Anderson to punch guys. <laughs> There's so many people in the Luke, ring. Luke Gallows. Oh! oh, oh Undertaker oh, big boat and cane on accident. He missed. Oh my god. Undertaker missed the boot. Undertaker missed the boot. He's so disoriented. There's so many people in the south. Another slam from Gallows. Gallows is going for the pin. Undertaker might be too slow. Did he get it? He got it. That's it. It's Go. the OC. OC has a pin now. OC and Young Bucks at one and one. One and one. 20 minute oh. time limit. Two Top stone. Two I look. Suck. 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 <laughs> Young Bucks smell it. They smell a victory. Oh, Carl Anderson just in the nick of time. Undertaker's calling it. He's saying it's over. Said, I've seen so many tombstones and not one of them done by me. Oh, oh. The car oh, breaks it. Luke right after just saved. 
He just saved Nick Jackson from a tombstone. Luke Gallows got to get out. Those seen. Uh oh. And the young but Matt Jackson. Their time. But is it really their time? Oh. Tombstone on Matt Jackson. But Undertaker's. He can't so recover. Tired. So Kane has to. He says, take it away. Two. It's all tied up. It's anyone's ball game. Spare, Spare. Spare from Nick. This is pandemonium. <laughs> Carl Anderson beat up Kane. Low kick from Matt. The Young Bucks are looking good. <gasps> no <laughs> way. Going for the pin. Matt Jackson's doing the crucifix pin on him. Two Callis to get He doesn't know what's happening. Nick's trying to pin. Did he get it? Undertaker kicked out. Ah. Oh. Super Jackson kick on Carl Anderson. The Young Bucks can do it. Pin the corner. Can King get there? Oh. Gets there. Breaks it up. It's, it's so close. Oh. oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Kane gets super punch into the cage. There's only two people in the ring. Matt Jackson and Carl Anderson. Oh my Another god. Suspended DDT. Kane, he's going up into the top rope. What is the big yeah. man doing? Oh, he's eating. Uh. He's eating great <laughs> balls. Matt Jackson's on fire, but now fresh Luke Gallows. Good dodge from Kane. Oh my god, Kane is pissed. Spear! Another spear! On Luke! Kane goes for the pin! Kane. Kane trying to steal it. He, I don't think he realized how hard this match would be. The Brothers of Destruction may have been off more than they can chew. It's just a fucking bar brawl in here. Oh my Punch god! Left and right. Nick Jackson tries to spin out the ring. Goes Kane to the outside. Oh. Super kick. Super kick. I mean, Luke Gallows. I'm so sorry. But Kane's coming there. He breaks it up. This could be it. Oh, oh ripcord. Ripcord goes on. Both men down. Nick Jackson's the only one standing. He needs to make a pin. He needs to do something. This is your chance. Undertaker. No. Oh, Gallows <laughs> coming in. Uh oh. Undertaker's up. Oh boy, they got him in the corner. Oh, who reverses it? But it doesn't see Taker. Taker lifted <laughs> him up to the Tobestown. But Carl, Carl Anderson's, Anderson's there. Right there. What is he what doing? He's unloading. He's unloading. Oh, on he's on Kane. He doesn't see Kane. him. What is he doing? That's it. That's it. Wait, what? What? Oh, it, the pins counts different on each person. You have to pin the same oh team twice. Oh my god. We're still going 18 still minutes. 18 minutes. <laughs> Silver kick. This is going to oh, be it. I can't keep track of. So, oh, nice follow. So, Brunson of Destruction have a pin on both teams. Well, what is Matt Jackson doing? What's Matt this? Matt Jackson! Oh no! Oh, Undertaker catches him! <laughs> no! Dom Stone! Oh my god! Straight to hell! Blood spurned out of his head! Now what if that should have been it? Carl Anderson's a bloody mess! Carl Anderson, pick it up! Oh my oh. god! Laying him out! Tom Matt Jackson, breaking the pin! Tornado cutter! Nick Jackson doesn't even know where to go. Matt Jackson might actually be dying in the ring. <laughs> uh oh, Nick. Matt Jackson. DDT. Oh! Big kick to the midsection. Kane. Undertaker. Kane. Kane is trapped in the ropes. Kane is getting trapped. Out. He needs to get out. Oh my god, he's trapped. He gets out. <laughs> this is. I've never seen that. Sidewalk slam. But now we got. Matt Jackson, going to work on The Undertaker. It's reversed. Whoa, my God, what is Undertaker doing here with Matt Jackson? Oh, and too slow. Matt Jackson, spinning elbow, or flying elbow, really. Now well, Kane's in there by himself. What's Luke Nick Gallows. doing? Super kick on uh, Kane! 
Gallows scoops, slam, throw away slam. He doesn't see the ten. Beyond box. Oh my god. The streak is broken. Under the bronze of destruction. Finally lose in the most ridiculous match I think we've ever seen on CTW. Oh just my the amount of spears. God. The super kicks. That's it, the tombstone. We sh this 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 was the graveyard in Detroit. That's what we just watched. The young Here are your winners. Look at that. <laughs> Look at the face of Nick Jackson. Look at the blood. I mean, right. that's... <gasps> Nick Jackson got broken up from the very beginning, and Luke Gallows just grinded his face against the cage. And it didn't get any easier from there. Look at their faces. That's the faces of a true tag team champion. Tag team that, champion. They've been in TLC. They've been in table ladder matches. matches. Table matches. First Hell in the Cell match, and they deep roam the Brothers of Destruction. Five fucking stars. <laughs> Full lo fully loaded is delivering. And you know who else delivers? DoorDash. You get premium meals from your favorite restaurants delivered right to you for only a small fee. Tip your drivers. And remember, if you're hungry, DoorDash. Use code BOOM with your uh, order at DoorDash. You know who likes DoorDash? Ric Flair. Ric Flair drips yes, on some does. DoorDash. Yes. The following contest <laughs> is scheduled for... Ric Flair, I mean. Triple H must like the DoorDash. It seems getting a little bit of a gut, you know what I mean? Maybe a little too much DoorDash? Maybe too much DoorDash. John Moxley, though, he is the DoorDash. He delivers, and he wants that CTW Voltage Championship. Yes, John Moxley's going to be looking to deliver a paradigm shift squarely on Randy Orton and become the new Voltage Champion. First time he's had that belt, he's had two others. Randy Orton, I mean, the Legend Killer's debut match, Came wins out, the belt. Defeated Sting. A, I mean, he's the Legend Killer, and that's what he did. You see Ric Flair scurry to catch up. Uh, I mean, Ric Flair with the drip, man. I think he's been having a little bit of the bubbly. I bet you that's not water in Triple H's uh, water bottle there. A little bit of vodka. A little bit of that cranberry for good old Rick back there. Probably why he's not spitting it. Batista also showing up for the very first time here in CTW. The whole... Just, they're all they're all here they're finally all here the gang's all here and I would expect to see these men in a 3v3 match not too far down the road and someone is getting hyped out there with Rick you see that Rick's dancing out there with someone Man, look at the size of Batista. Oh, look at Moxley, though. Look at he might go over there and fucking fuck up Brick, dude. <laughs> yeah. Evolution is here. <laughs> uh, doing each other's poses. We love each other so much. You know, sometimes you gotta, you gotta be funny. I mean, gotta, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, voltage. I like the lightning there. Introducing the challenger. Look at Moxley's eyes. 
He is not here to fuck around. Dude. Look at that. Oh, Triple H may have bought vodka, but Moxley brought meth. Randy Orton, your vault is champion. The CTW debut, killing the legend Sting. He's not here to mess around. He, he knows who's held that belt. Sting, Drew McIntyre, one time Chris Jericho. A lot riding on this. This is Moxley's first chance at a big belt. Let's see how he handles the pressure. Now he also has the Keep in mind that there's three people outside the ring there that are um, not scared to get inside. Listen to this crowd. Randy, Randy. Oh, man, bumping oh. into each other. Ooh. Nice uppercut. Ooh. Heavy handed. Neck breaker. Man, super evenly matched so far. A good back elbow. <laughs> I think this match is going to be determined by who can who can control the pace, who can control the tone, right. because they both have very similar styles. Look at this. Oh my each God. time, Dragon Screw. Each time one of them gets something going, the other person counters it. Oh my God. Whoa. Moxley Look at that. Ducking headbutt. Out of that drop and get to a headbutt into a bulldog. Boom. Moxley right might get there. some breathing room here. Oh, Randy catches him sleeping. It's a clothesline to the back. Triple H is liking what he's seeing. One. Oh, oh, man. Oh, <laughs> Randy Orton was not really paying attention. Just getting blinded by the lights of the crowd. Those cameras. That oh. energy. <laughs> it's a stop to the jaw. Not even one. Remember, we do have money in the bank people here that have been identified oh, nice. as being here tonight. So, Shark Boy can... He could cash in if you wanted to. Yes, he could. Never know what's going to happen here at CTW. That's why it's one of the best wrestling organizations today. The best, John. The best. The best. Triple H using that triple Gillette action. That smooth head. Praying. Ooh, man. It's a nice elbow to the head. Really working the neck of Randy Orton. You know, I, I just keep thinking, if that last match was a first blood match, it would have been over in two seconds. Yes. And I wouldn't be surprised if both of these men were bleeding by the end of this match. Very, very close. Very grueling. Ooh. Oh. Nice elbow. Oh. With a huge clothesline. Look at Between this. The room. He's getting pissed at Ric Flair. Oh, you can't talk to the dirtiest player in the game. The one time Moxley gets a nice advantage. Stops Randy. He's fighting back. Oh, nice. Get you got everything behind RKO. that one. Oh, I thought he was going for it. Oh, my God. Hanging DDT! Yes! This might be it. John Moxie's in trouble. Randy Orton wants <laughs> it. He needs it. Better's about to strike. Oh, RKO. Triple H smells victory. Two. Three. What? Just like that. Yeah. What? Response time. 
Man, Randy Orton is really, I would say, dominating. Um, well, the match, well, that's the thing. The match was super close. Yeah, it was back and forth, but it, at the end there. super close. And then, yeah, it, that distraction from Ric Flair. Right. It allowed Randy the, Orton to get his breath. Let the and then, strike. Yep. So right after this, that's when Ric Flair distracted him. And then what happened? DDT. Randy Orton got a hold of him. DDT. RKO. Straight into the RKO. And Randy Orton Here is your still. And still all-star champion. Your voltage he champion. Is the Apex Predator. The Viper. Randy Orton. There you go. But are you ready for this match? Are you ready oh, for this match? What? Wait. Oh boy. Do you know about this, Sutter? Don't know about what? Kevin Nash and Christian? Well, I knew it was Christian. I didn't know who he was going to face. He's the new fire champion. Defeating Scott Hall. So. so how does Scott Hall get all the way up to this? How, do, how does this happen? Kevin Nash. Look at listen to this crowd. Oh, wait, wait I, I got the report here. Scott Hall said he could not compete due to injury and was able to send, he elected. Kevin Nash as his replacement because he did not want the match to go unfinished. And he said uh, Kevin Nash is just as worthy of a championship match as he is. So he deferred his rematch for Kevin Nash. Well, look at, look at that sign. That. Tag me in. It's exactly what Scott Hall did. He tagged Kevin Nash in to see if he could retain the fire championship for the Wolfpack. You think Scott Hall is actually injured, or is this I don't, trying I don't to give know. his buddy a, a might match? Be playing some mind games here, but Christian definitely playing mind games with the whole universe, coming back and going on an absolute tear, beating Scott Hall after Scott Hall's huge streak and winning that fire belt. Christian may have the greatest rise to championships I've ever seen. Absolutely insane rise from really nowhere. Right? Everyone thought he was retired. Everyone right. thought he was gone. And what does he do? He comes in. He faces Shinsuke Nakamura. Destroys him. Shinsuke, of course, is a great competitor. But he just Not runs right through him. Then Holiday Slam, he beats Finn, AJ, Kevin Nash, Luchasaurus, Bobby Roode in an absolutely insane elimination match. Yeah, and now and, well, actually that was a over the over the top rope elimination style. Now you have, I mean, he beats Scott Hall. Beats Scott right. Hall. Last and episode the of Fire is just behind them. Well, I'm behind them. I mean, I know I'm not supposed to be, but I'm fucking am. Look at that, Captain Charisma. He's he's Hans. he's Fire's champion. Absolutely, the people's champion. It's my the champion peeps. and yours. If you're watching this at home. I'm sure he's your champion too. CGW Fire Championship is on the, the line. Challenger. Here we go. Crash and neck breaker by Kevin Nash. Christian standing right up. Uh oh. Christian chance gets, though. Gets swatted like a fly. Kevin Nash is a much bigger man. Might have that height advantage. The size Easy. advantage. 
Oh, for sure. Strength advantage. Man, look at this just unloading on this champion. The crowd hates every second of this. Kevin Nash is dominating. Oh Not one God, second lose. of offense. Oh my God, Shoot. 300 pounds of elbow on your sternum. What's he gonna do here? Oh, and again, oh. goes into a cover. Come on. Oh, Christian kicks out. Oh my, oh my God. God. Rattling the cage there of Christian. Wow. Look at this. It's like the camel clutch, but he's squeezing the head. Oh, Christian fighting out. That's what Christian has to do. He has to go on those legs of Kevin Nash. Big DDT. Oh, giant elevated DDT. And Christian's starting to move now. Clothesline. <laughs> and into another clothesline. Oh, oh God. Tell the world backbreaker on Kevin Nash. He could have just Christian. broke him in half. Christian is doing exactly what he needs to. Bitch slap, oh, Kevin Nash. Oh, 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 oh. You're sick of the NWO running everything here at CDW. It's Christian's time. It's Captain Charisma's time. Oh, nice. Sliding into first. The first was Kevin Nash's skull. Christian going up top. What's he doing? Frog, Frog splash. splash. Dead center. Is it enough? One, two. Oh, it's a two count. Kevin Nash is noticeably slowing down. Dropping an elbow of his own. Uh-oh, Christian. He's looking for it. Can he wrap those arms around? That's going to be a big if. Can Christian even do the kill switch on Kevin Nash? Russian leg sweep by Kevin Nash. Good joke. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. This doesn't look good. Oh, my oh. God. No. Jack. Jack knife. Knife. That Power bomb. One. Come on. Two. Christian. Christian. Oh. He's still in it. He survives. What does Kevin Nash have left? Uh-oh. Oh, no. Another oh. elbow. Kevin Ash is thinking what he can do. Well, he used his whole move set to abuse right? Christian. Oh, Christian just gets pushed back. Oh, he's still fighting though. These guys are wolves. They're the wolf oh, pack. Nice. Oh my God, Christian! Push him the ropes. Punch in the spine. Use the ring to his advantage. Kevin Ash kicks at one. Christian, very intelligently. Yes, targeting the mid and lower back of Kevin Nash. Oh, wow, nice. Look at that push down the obliques. Trying to tear the arm arms. out of the socket. Yes, exactly. Looking for the... Getting ready. Might see another frog splash here for Christian. Are you feeling froggy, Christian? Let's say it. Oh, oh, a second one. Beautiful. Oh, that would hurt Christian a little bit, too. He wants Kevin Nash up. What is he going to do here? He's tired. It's, it's taking him a while to pick him up all the way. Oh, oh. man. No. Thought Christian might have went up, was gonna go up to the top rope again. Might have been a good idea. Kevin Nash lays Christian out. He took too long. Oh, oh my, my gosh. God! A huge elbow. Oh. And Christian surprisingly able to take Kevin Nash down. No, a little bit of edge. A little bit of edge here tonight. Spare, spare, spare. spare. Taking the one out of his brother's arsenal. Uh, slides into the ring. Two. Kevin Nash. Uh, 
kicks out. Christian can't believe his eyes. The last second, Kevin Nash kicks out of the spear. Oh, that was. This is not where you want to be underneath oh. Kevin Nash. Whoa. Big boot. Oh my gosh. Picks him up by the throat. Hits the boot. One, two, two. three. Kevin oh. Nash <laughs> is your new. Oh man. CTW Fire Champion. Oh, the, the big boots is too much. Big boot was too much for. Christian, Christian is still on the ground, out cold in the middle of the ring. Look at—he doesn't even want the belt. Kevin Nash doesn't even want the belt. Why? What's Kevin Nash thinking? No! Oh Kevin no! Kevin Nash! Oh! To Christian. Oh my God! Come on! <laughs> Come on! What the hell's wrong with him? Oh my god! Kevin Nash didn't even take the belt, laying Christian out after the match with a chair. Well, man, I know, I know we said that six man match was going to be the craziest, craziest of the night, but. Man, I'm so disappointed that Christian, but it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter because we have a slobber knocker. Yeah, a coming literal up. slobber knocker coming up. Duke Thompson fighting his way straight to the top of the heavyweight division, laying everyone out in the super the duper holiday slam. Champion contest is a defeating hell everyone a there to match. then defeating in the Braun Strowman. The super heavyweight championship. It is exactly. And it's now he's <laughs> going for the super heavyweight championship. Oh, he's coming out representing that smoking skull belt that he took away from AT3. AT3 was defending the belt and saying it didn't really matter. Maybe this is Duke trying to show that the smoking skull belt does matter. I mean, that or he just does it because he know it's going to piss off AT3. Yeah. Like I, Taz, when he, when he couldn't get over it, couldn't get that belt. He just made his own. his own fucking belt. I mean... It, it, that's completely possible. I, I would love to pay a penny for Alan's thoughts right now, John. I mean, well, I'm, I bet I'm you almost Alan's surprised. This and I bet you he's pissed. I know. I almost want to text him just to see what he does, but maybe it's best I just, you know, leave it alone. He's been acting, I don't know, different. Oh, listen to the booze. Dude, Thompson, though, he's getting ready. So this crowd is a lot of booze, but I can hear the yes. Brock Lesnar mark stand yes. out. Take a look at that belt. Andre the Giant right there, smack dab in the middle. Take a look at that beast incarnate. Defeating Braun Strowman, taking out that monster streak here at CGW. Now looking to defeat another monster here tonight in a Hell in a Cell match. Undo's pacing outside. He wants to make sure he doesn't take turn on the wrong exit and go to Suplex City tonight. He might just he he's probably gonna end up going to Suplex City. And look at that guy has the sign of Suplex City. He knows we're here in Detroit, Michigan. It's Suplex City here tonight. Here on Fully Loaded. Just like my brother, I love Brock Lesnar. Introducing the challenger from Great Falls, Montana, weighing in at 341 pounds. He is the WWE champion, man. the 
Duke Thompson. Introducing Those the eyes. champion from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at Guys are just staring each other down. Pounds. He is the super heavyweight champion, Brock Lesnar. Again, a, a, a lot of cheers there, but it's you can still hear the booze. A lot of people on Sherman Brock Lesnar. Or it could be some of the booze just excited for this match. When giants collide here. The giants collide here on CTW. Fully loaded. The cage lowering down. These men getting ready. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Oh! And a suplex from Duke to start it off. Belly to belly. And he's just stomping on the midsection of Brock Lesnar. Crowd squat in Suplex City. Remember, this is a KO match. Oh, Duke doesn't let him oh, pick him up. Line. Duke going oh up God. top, 340 pounds. Big elbow. Oh. Macho Man style off the top rope. Brock is pissed. Just shoulder tackles. Oh, look at this. He's, <laughs> getting, he's getting pumped up. That guy's booing. Look at that guy. He's so pissed. Look at this move. <laughs> oh, my oh. God. You imagine if he threw him in a cage like that. Throw away power slam. Or, uh, just body slam. Throw away body slam. Brock Lesnar not even knowing where to go with this. Blocks. Oh, Look at the MMA background coming to into play here. That's Brock with a solid striking he's gonna defense. Here. It's gonna have to knock out Duke Thompson. And look, at, and look at that. Strong right hands. Clothesline oh. from Duke. Those clotheslines really landing for Duke. This is what he needs to do. Don't let, don't grapple with Brock, right? He's that strong oh, wrestling man. background. Do this. Three. Just keep taking him off his feet. Oh my God. <laughs> Drop kicking Duke. I mean, Brock. <laughs> Into the corner. And. Uh oh. Uh oh. Duke's You've trying to get spicy. Before. It's the Avalanche pedigree. Can he hit it? Wait. Here it comes. Oh. And just splats Brock. Completely splats him. Has him up. What's no. he doing? Oh, okay. Snake eyes. <laughs> I thought you found him with F5. I would have lost it. 100% lost it. Duke, Duke is in complete is control of this himself. match. After getting so close and then just getting totally knocked off the oh. map, coming back from surgery, Duke's got to feel pretty good about getting his title shot again. Climbing the ladders here uh -oh. in CTW. Uh-oh. He's going to climb those ladders in Suplex City, baby. Brock's got the hand grip in. Three Germans in a row. Look at this. The strength of the oh, Iron Claw Slam. Oh my God. Stop. Devastating it. stops. Uh oh. Brock's looking to end it here. Doesn't even take matter. Take him for a ride. Sell. They can take it right here in the ring. F5. <sighs> Oh my god. Brock, Brock. The strength. From pro. Oh god. my god. god. Got wrench. Tail to whirl. Slam. Look at that. Duke's right back up. But Brock is just right back on him. 
Little amateur wrestling there. Remember, you gotta knock out your opponent here. Oh, and we're going God. outside. We're going outside, Duke. Right, just stepping right over that rope. And the crowd is watching eagerly. You got your money's worth at these seats, I'll tell you what. Right hand I brought. Oh, Duke falls against the cage. Brock. Brock is just knocking him against it. Down. Like the beast that he is. <laughs> Takes it down with the clothesline. Making Duke Thompson his prey. <laughs> Duke can't get up. He just keeps getting battered everywhere he goes. Listen, this these, is. Oh. This is just two big men. Duke got an elbow there. And now it's his turn. To do some extra damage with this cage. Wow. But well, using this, the cage here is going to be an advantage. You got to knock him out. Using the cell. Absolutely. You can cut them. You can make them tired. And yes, both men just happy to just slam each other every which way out here. Look at this. Oh my god. Brock just trips over a wire or something out there. Yeah, I saw that. That was crazy. Duke's trying again. Oh. Slammed him against the cell there. Oh my god. Brock is flying <laughs> Duke down. Look at this. Look at it. Look at it. Look at his posture. <laughs> Look at his stance. Look at his just the way he walks. Big right hand. Oh my oh, god. Oh super kick attempt from Brock. Be a super kick attempt. And Duke wants no more of this outside nonsense. Oh. Oh, he's got him. He's got him by the face. Oh, oh. my God. The Iron Claw choke slam. Or does Iron Claw slam, I guess? Big neck breaker. Brock might be in trouble here. Oh! Duke reverses with a gut kick. Brock in the corner. Duke likes to put people up here. Over yeah. the snake eyes. Brock's going to watch out getting those corners from Duke. Just want to get in that avalanche pedigree. One of the most devastating moves here in CTW. Oh my god. Are we going to see another one? Oh A third. Let's and Brock's out. Oh my it. god. Duke Dawson climbed all the He's way. Done. He's done it. Duke Dawson is now your CTW World Heavyweight Champion. After three Iron Claw choke slams, after an Absolutely. onslaught outside of the ring, right? He weathered the storm. He weathered the cell, the storm cell, you could almost say, and came out on top. Three Iron Claw slams sealed the deal. The psycho Duke Thompson. I mean, Duke has to be. What a story. Think about it. When he gets all the way up, gets destroyed, humiliated by Braun, and then has to go into surgery, gets injured, comes back, and goes on a war path to defeat Brock Lesnar. Knocking Brock Lesnar out. I've never seen that before. Like, oh my gosh. Well, that's. 18 that's 3 all right now. I bet you he is going insane wherever he's at. Oh, absolutely. Him and Duke were really, really having some heated moments. Especially, he called him out. Not only does he have his fake belt, now he has the real heavyweight one. Uh, anyways, that's all we have here in Detroit. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. And uh, John and I, we will see you next time. Adios.